Hi, it's Dawson. I've been away from YouTube for quite a while, and coming back, I'm going to be changing my channel here to more of a macro photography, astrophotography, and praying mantis care and uh, instruction. So, with this video, is an unboxing for the Wii Macro um, focus stacking rail. And there's only one or two other videos out there. And before I purchased this, I really wanted to know a little more. Um, so with this, we're going to be going through and showing you everything that's in the box. And yeah, so lots of peanuts, as you can see. So this um, focus rail is from China, and you can, I think it's wemacro.com, w-e-m-a-c-r-o.com, and it's a competitor to uh, the stack shot. The stack shot is very expensive, and it was not in my budget, so we're giving this a shot. So up until now you have seen, I believe, a packing slip and an invoice uh, also where it cleared magnetic scanning in China for export. Uh, when I did get this, it, they said up to three months for delivery uh, due to coronavirus. Thank you for that. Uh, but it actually took six days, I believe. So what else was in the box? You saw a nice little card. Uh, it's just a thank you card coming from the company. Uh, instruction manual, which I will actually use, and I'm going to follow those instructions in the second part of this video. So here we are with the AC adapter. This is for the actual unit itself. I would definitely recommend labeling this, as later you'll see there is a separate charger, which um, it's for another component. So I would label that one there. And my battery died. Always the way. Um, and here we go. I'm gonna grab my sexy purple X-Acto knife, which you would have thought that I would have had it Close to the computer, but of course not. And this here is the second adapter that you should also label. <clears throat> it is out of focus, but the label there does say that this is for the outside box only. Um, so this has, it comes with uh, an 18650 battery pack, uh, which can be used for outdoor use. Uh, I will probably never use this outside um, in the field. So there you go, three 18650 batteries, which you have to supply yourself. There is the cable to connect to the control box, as well as the AC adapter to charge those batteries. And this here was the stepper motor cable. Connects the control box to the stepper itself. And here they include two nylon screws, which you use to support your lens if you're using a long lens or if you have a couple extent sets of extension tubes. Um, the Wii Macro, as well as other users of the product, have suggested that the, um, the ring support, which is available on the website, is the better option. Uh, adds more stability, especially if you're using something like a microscope objective on the end of uh, bellows or extension tubes. And here is the control box. This is the brains of the uh, stepper here. Got a couple ports there, USB, looks like the power in and an on off switch. And that's where that 
got the control cable is going to plug in. Uh, it's pretty good quality. Feels like aluminum, I believe. Um, it actually felt better than I thought it was going to. Um, <clears throat> better quality, anyway. And also included in the kit is this little specimen holder. Uh, it's basically just an alligator clip attached to a tiny tripod. It'll work, though the legs are thin plastic. Um, you could like bend them, I think. But for insects and tiny things, it, it's gonna work fine. Um, what do we have here? This is the shutter release cable extension cord. Um, I believe that's one size comes, it doesn't matter on the camera. And the USB cord, we got this end that'll plug into the control box. And the other end, which is a standard USB, I believe they're 2.0. Um, this will connect to your computer. Uh, you can use this rail either tethered or um, Bluetooth, I believe. So here's the shutter release cable. It has one end that's gonna connect into your that extension cable that we just showed a couple minutes ago, and the other end will go right into the control box. So those ones, uh, you do have to select the model of your camera on the website, and they will send you the appropriate one. Uh, if you scroll to the bottom of the website, it'll give you a list of uh, what cable type and what camera type you just match them up and make your selection. And here is the actual rail itself. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, it is, it feels well constructed. Uh, it's pretty heavy. I, I want, I'm not actually sure exactly how much it weighs, but I, it doesn't feel like it's going to be slipping around or anything like that. Um, so there on the top you have a quick release plate as well as the tripod mount that goes into your camera. Uh, just the two ends there. At the bottom, multiple uh, places to attach it. It's also on a dovetail rail, which if you have a, a saddle that'll work. And there in the back, you see where the control box connects to the stepper. All right. So what I'll be doing in the next video, I'm going to go through the instruction manual and go step by step. And uh, I'll record that as I set it up. Peace.